Hey yo, this is part 20 of Clinton Plays Pokemon Legends Arceus. Thank you for watching, for vibing, and let's get into it and play. All right, let's go fight this Reggie, Richie Gigas. I'm gonna try to go this way instead. <laughs> Why does that look like something? Hmm. I feel like the other the other Reggies to fight are probably in here. Like actually, no, because um, get get away from me. Get away from me. <laughs> oh, gotta go. Got to go. Yeah, I knew it. You don't get your behind away, away. Which one, which one? Oh shit. Ah! Oh, I, I was I was right. I knew it. I knew it. Damn, I think it's charging at me. Wait. Oh. Oh, so this is to get spirit tomb, huh? Interesting. Okay. We're collecting all the souls. Hmm. What in time is that thing? It's colossal. It sure seems to be a Pokemon, but let's see what my clairvoyance has to say. Yep, definitely a Pokemon. My clairvoyance showed me a vision of its motion. Alright, time to save. Again. Cut out that cutscene. And I think we get to meet Arceus after this. We'll see. Damn it, this is not who I want. Oh, this remix. Ding, 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 ding. What is Reggie Reg Gigas? Is it normal? I need, to, I need to check. I don't remember. Oh. I don't know what your typing is. I always thought Richie Gigas looked so cool. Normal, yeah. But it, it can use hella moves. I just I do remember that part. Um, let's use more time. Ooh, okay, halfway. <laughs> Let's try for a Pokeball. Oh, that's my last Ultra Ball. Shit, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't buy. Oh no. Well, this is going to be very interesting. Uh, and I only have Great Balls left. Um, well, it's going to have to do. It's going to have to do. Okay, I'll take it. Blank play. Oh, the normal for normal. Mm -hmm. Now that was one solid Pokemon, like a giant born from the earth. I guess this is just part of your job with the Survey Corps, huh? What kind of Pokemon is the one you just caught, Clint? Hmm. I can't wait to see it in the Pokedex when it's when it's done. Yeah, I'm pretty curious to read everything that Mr. Professor writes up too. 
See, Clinton, we should do another chase sometime. And that's the last plate. All right, let's go back to Kokita. Um, can we go back to the camp from here? Yeah, cool. Let's see what she has to say. Let's see what she has to say. Boom, 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 boom. Here you are again. Have you collected all the plates? Of course, Clinton is a famed member of the Survey Corps anyway. So what more can you tell us? We're so close now. You must know more about the plates. If there's yet more you want to know? Kindly bring me wood. Three logs will do. Wood? So you're saying wood is somewhat tied to the plates? Well, I suppose that's what we get to learn next. Hop to, Clinton. While it shames me to admit it, merchant that I am, I'm quite out of the wood in my stories just now. What the heck? I don't think I... Do I have any wood? I, I might. I got two. Of course I got two. Uh, well, let's go find a piece of wood then. Um, wait, can I find some here, please? <laughs> I don't think so. Okay, we can probably find some, like, real quick. See, and this is where fast travel to other um, areas would come in handy. But it's all... Actually, who... Hold on, hold on. Someone sells... Ingredients. You. No, you don't have wood. Damn. Um, what about the shop? Because you, you upgraded. Nope. Nope, pretty nope, nope. Um, actually, I'm going to... Get some of these. And sell some of these. So I can get some more of these. Because I'm going to have to face Arceus soon. I'm curious how that's going to go. Um, yeah, we'll just go to, uh, just go somewhere quick. Okay, let's find some, oops. Let's find some wood. Um, I don't know particular spots to find wood, but it's probably by some trees. Well, this would be a good, good chance for me to go ahead and just gather materials too. I thought that was a mud kid. I was like, hold on, wait a minute. I want you, I want you. Now I need to get a back strike. Oh, 
Oh no, I can't see. Damn it. It saw me. It saw me. It saw me. Okay, cool, we got another one because I want to get the other EV illusions. I am seeing everything but wood. But don't fret, we will find some. I already caught you, so I don't know. I'm gonna I'm let you be. I'm gonna let you stay over there and I stay over here. Oh, my. <laughs> I, um, I realized I gave the village member the wrong type of worm pool. And he's expecting a beauty fly, and he's about to get a cast, uh, the other type. I forget what that's called. Duskoon? Or something like that? I don't know. Girl, give me some wood. Wait, can I get wood from the trees? I don't know. There we go. Some wood. Let me go ahead and put it in my inventory. Okay. I'm surprised there's not a, um, actually, no, no, I'm not surprised. I was going to say there's no breeder in this game, but I'm like, you don't really need one. Oh, she's going to make the flute. I think so. The flute to, um, I think that's what it is to call Arceus is the, it's a flute. If there's yet more you want to know, kindly bring me what three logs will do. Have you gathered the three logs? Lost one. Oh yes, this is this ought, this certainly ought to do. Now the moment comes at last. The big reveal. What pray tell is the secret behind this wood? Secret? Your expectations need tempering, I fear. This wood is merely for fashioning myself new cutting boards. What the hell? Cutting boards? You mean for cooking? The plates we're after aren't dinner plates. So this is hardly the time for cooking. How can you complain for one shirking his own work this very moment? Poor Ginter of the Ginkgo Guild must have his hands full with you. But honest work earns honest pay. Here you are, Clinton. A reward for the wood you've brought me. Girl for a cutting board? Oh. Okay. Oh, yeah. That's one of the plates we're looking for. <laughs> Apologies. There's indeed one of the that's indeed one of the plates we've been searching for. What do you mean a plate? Let me see that again. <clears throat> it this does ra rather look like one of the plates you've been tracking down. While the engravings upon it made it less than accommodating as a cutting board, whatever ingredients crossed it certainly gained a more pleasant flavor. Perhaps that was the board's power, the plate's power rather. She. <laughs> well, no more need saying. What do you two intend to do, intend to do now? Well, we managed to collect quite a lot of plates now, but I still don't know what we're to do with them exactly. It's just a hunch, but perhaps we should look around the Seleska ruins. Those ruins contain statues of both Dialga and Palkia. They might hold some more secrets. I see. I find pretext to continue shirking your mercantile <laughs> duties to crawl around in old ruins as you so enjoy. On with you then. The tension between them? <laughs> I don't need you to tell me. I'm going. That's the Celestica Runes, Clinton. I'll see you there. Go on now, to the Celestica Runes. I'm curious myself what you'll find there. What can we, who live now, learn from the remains of our ancient myths and legends? Right, here we go. Here we go. Yes, please.
Have a look at this, Clinton. It wasn't broken like that before, right? The statue has been kept here, far from statues of Dayalka and Palkia. Broken and shattered, and yet it remains. Do you know what this is? I think so. Of course you would. You're the greatest wielder of Pokemon this land knows. The one who could bring low even Dialga and Palkia. This crumbling stone statue was once a figure of a Pokemon. One that was equal to both Dialga and Palkia, yet vanished from our world. That great Pokemon, Giratina. Oh! It was banished for its violence, left to dwell in a world on the reverse side of our own. It is, be it is a being that has lain in wait for the chance to bear its fangs in defiance and tear down Arceus itself. Now tell me, if this Giratina desires more than anything else to challenge Almighty Arceus, where do you think it might appear? Uh, I don't know, the Temple of Sinnoh? Exactly, where one is closer to the heavens than any other place in Hisui, and where the space-time rift first opened. <laughs> I can feel it. We're getting closer to uncovering the secrets of this world. I dare say the excitement is loosening my lips more than it should, but... You see, ever since I was young, whenever I met something painful and heart or heartbreaking, I couldn't help but wonder why life was so unfair. Why I was cursed to live through such things. Of course, I imagine we all go through something like that. Eventually, I chose to direct all my energy into my own natural curiosity and ambition. And what tickled my curiosity more strongly than anything were the mysteries to be found in legends and history and ruins. You see, I fancied that by unraveling these mysteries, I could find out the world itself came to be, and with that knowledge, maybe even forge a new, better world. Now, if we can find the realm that exists on the reverse side of our world, meet the creators and wants a child banished therein, perhaps then we'll be able to understand the nature of Almighty Sinnoh itself. Don't you want to see it with your own eyes? We must make, make for the Temple of Sinnoh at Mount Coordinates Peak. Dialga and Palkia appear, both appear from within the rift that once gaped open there, didn't they? These plates can call anything at all. It seems likely that is where it would appear. All right, let's see. I don't think I can just go there. No, I can't. That's okay, though. Them. Oh, hey. Damn. I was going to try. Did I get, um, I did. I'm not going to waste these. I want you, but I can come back for you. I can't go this way? Oh, I forgot I have to go. <laughs> Let me save. Here we go. This music. The temple lies in ruins now. Columns cracked and broken, like pillars now turned into spears, stabbing into the heavens. While I detected a distinct lack of Giratina, 
Hmm. Is something bothering you? Ah, I do beg your pardon. I suppose I must seem to be behaving strangely. I dare say you deserve to know what I really am after now. Ever since I became convinced that Arceus really does exist, there has been one question that consumed my thoughts. How can I meet such a being myself? It was an attempt to answer this question that I originally sought out Giratina and had to tear open the rift in space-time. Oh, after all, Giratina wished to stand against Arceus, but that didn't do the trick. So then I had you gathered the fragments of the all-encompassing uh, deity, such as the uh, murals um, of the ruins that directed. 18 plates set to be the fragments of the all-encompassing deity. You holding your hand 17 of them. So you must be wondering, where's the last one? You got it. Well, it's right here. All right, re reveal. What the heck? What the heck? Now hand over the plates you gathered. I will be the one to bring them all together. My desire to meet Arceus cannot be contained any longer. I need to know what it is. I must know what it is. If I can meet Arceus myself, then I may also be able to subjugate its power. And using that, I will attempt to create a new, better world. Of course, if I create a brand new world, then this Hisui region that we currently exist in will be undone and returning to nothing. You, everyone you know, and all the Pokemon living here will vanish in an instance, as if you've never been. If you want to keep this world from disappearing, then face me in battle. Now that you have a choice, even if you do don't wish to battle me, I'm not above using force to take those plates from you. Oh shit, okay. Was not expecting this. Okay, I saw that little leg. <laughs> you almost tripped. Um, shit. Sphere Tomb. Him having Cynthia's theme? Oh shit. Okay, okay. Uh. <laughs> um. I, I can switch. I can switch, actually. All done for part 20 of Clinton Plays Pokemon Legends Arceus. Thank you, thank you so much for, again, the support, for being yeah, here, and just watching and vibing. I'll see you in the next one. Laters.